What's up guys, Zane here, and welcome back to another Final Fantasy XIV video. In this video, I'm going to be uh, showing you guys the uh, cycle to getting uh, blue uh, gatherer scripts. So, and when you are at a, um, a high enough level, you'll come to this little um, NPC here. She will give you the, um, the quest to, unlo to unlock them. And what you need to do to get the uh, collector's glove is you have to go to foundation. Now the NPC you need to be talking to should be next to the uh, Lev quest. So you would want to go up the street here. This NPC right here will be uh, giving you the ability collector's glove. So the first node that will be popping will be botanist and sea of clouds, the Abalthian uh, mistletoe. So let's switch to our botanist and head on over to the sea of clouds. Now this node doesn't pop until until at least 10 p.m. By the time we get to that, the area where the node would, would pop, it would be 10 o'clock. So let's hop on our mounts and head on over. Now I recommend that you guys um, do this when you got, while you while you have about I would say the serpent skin um, gear around there is probably the best or anything above that to uh, to do uh, these scripts script gathering. And you need at least 600. Oh, just hit the microphone. You need at least 600 um, GP for the rotation to work. Maybe a little bit more, like around 650. So you can use um, field mastery to get the 100% uh, gathering rate. Because believe me, at 5 or 4%, you still can get nothing. And that sucks. Especially when you have uh, enough collectability. So this node will pop in either two spots. This tree over here, and that tree between those two rocks over there. So in about 10 minutes of Yorzia time, we'll find out which uh, tree it pops at. Make sure you have your um, core drills ready to go because there's only about two hours in between each node. so. By the time the second one pops, you should have halfway there. Just pop a cordial and you'll be at full GP. Oh, make sure you have your uh, Truth of the Forest and your Collector's Glove on. Can't tell you how many times I forgot to do that. It should be popping soon. Ah, here we are. So it's this tree over here. So the, uh, the slot you want to hit is the, th the third slot. That's the uh, Albalthian mistletoe. So you click on it and you do discerning eye, methodical appraisal, discerning eye, methodical appraisal. Discerning Eye, Methodical Appraisal, Field Mastery, and now we collect. Okay, 
That is the basic rotation to get at least two. There's, there are others, but they're a little bit more complicated, but this is the most definite way of getting them. So, so the next um, node will be the uh, red quartz, which is on the other side. So you want to go to the Vanu Vanu. Come over here to Griffin's Island. Go this way. I call it Griffin's Island because, well, there's a bunch of griffins everywhere, so. So, around here is where the red quartz node will pop and that will AM. Yes, be 12 AM that's when, when it will pop. And also remember that these nodes will pop not only at 10 PM, but also 10 AM as well. So always remember that these nodes pop in two hour increments. And then the, the full rotation again, and we'll start until 10 PM or 10 AM and then start all over again. So. I will uh, see you in about an hour for the next node. Okay, so in about 15, uh, 14 or, or, or um, Eorzea minutes, the node should pop. So, because we're not going to be able to get the 650 GP by the 12 o'clock, we're going to pop a cordial. And either it will spawn over there or it will spawn over here. As you can see, we already have someone collecting. Now, some of you are probably already way past this point. You don't need the, these scripts anymore, but for all you new people out there who just uh, entered Heaven's Ward and are a crafter or gatherer, this video is definitely for you. All right, it's way over here. Okay, make sure you put your stealth on just in case. You go over this node and hit number the sixth slot. Make sure your um, Truth of the Mountains and uh, Collector's Glove is on. And you'll do the same thing over again. Discerning Eye, Methodical. Discerning Eye, Methodical. Discerning Eye, Methodical, and then um, Sharp Vision, which is the equivalent to the Field Mastery, and then now you collect. That one's really high on that one. Alright, so our next node will be at 2 a.m. in the Dravanian Hinterlands. So, I'll show you a, well, a quick way to get there. Uh, most people would go to Idleshire to get to get to this node, but because Idleshire usually is busy and loading times are really slow, depending on uh, how fast it is, it's best to go to the uh, Four Lands and go through Annex Trine. Since the node is basically outside of the um, zone entrance, it's faster doing this way. Now, if you are not, um, if you have only botanist, the 12 o'clock node is also a botanist equivalent in the hinterlands. It's where you'd be finding the, um, on the, um, the morel, it's a little tiny mushroom. I believe it's in the seventh slot, kind of like hovering above the area where Matoya's cave is. So, 
over around this um, area over here is where the uh, cup right will spawn at 2 a.m. or 2 p.m. depending on what time you're doing this. So I will see you guys in about an hour. Okay, so now the, sp um, the node will be spawning any, any minute now. So again, you pop a cordial. Alright, it's the uh, nodes over here this time. See other people is already uh, waiting as well. Now you want to use stealth here because these them cockatrice are going to be a uh, pain in the ass. Alright. Stealth. The second node on the second slot. And now we continue. Discerning eye. Methodical. Discerning eye. Methodical. Discerning eye. Methodical. And now a sharp vision. And we collect. Okay, so now that we went through the whole cycle, let's go back. You can either go to um, Mordona or you can go to found uh, not Foundation, um, Idleshire, depending which one you have available to pass these in. There's my free company mate doing the same thing I'm doing. I chose Mordona because it's faster to load in. Okay. I'll take a, make sure to take off stealth. I'll run up here. Go to the uh, collectible appraiser, appraiser. And you pass them in. Now these these ones will always be there. You don't have to worry about them running out. There's no timer on them, so you just basically pass them in. You always will get a maximum when you um, do it this way, depending on your gear level as well. And there you go. So yeah, there is the uh, rotation of um, blue uh, um, gather scripts that I follow every uh, 10 or p.m. or a.m. So hopefully you guys find this uh, video very helpful. Make sure to uh, like, subscribe to my channel for other uh, awesome Final Fantasy XIV videos. Don't forget to share it with your friends. We're also looking to do um, blue scripts. And in my next video, I will be showing you guys how to do the concealed and um, nodes and, and the favors. Because there's a lot of uh, new people not might not know how to do it. Some people don't know the tricks of saving time so you don't waste your nodes. So please look forward to that one. So until next time, take care. <laughs>